What's up everybody, Kwame here, back again with another video, and today I'm showing you the Bridge uh, Slim Protective Case for your 2017 or 2015 iPad Pro 12.9 12 inch. Uh, this is a case that if you have a Bridge keyboard, which I think I've talked about in other videos, I use the Bridge keyboard for my iPad all the time. I love this thing. It has like the aluminum um, keyboard and it's Bluetooth. The one problem is that it's open, like your iPad's exposed and open. So w without a case, I'm always afraid to use this like in public or throw it in a bag and stuff. So this case, protect this protective case here is from Bridge. Um, it used to be like $50. And the other day I saw yeah, you could get it on Amazon for $30. So I picked it up, or I think it was like $60. It was really expensive, but I picked it up. Uh, and so we'll check it out here. I haven't opened it up or anything. They have several different colors. I got the um, black color here. And you can see, well, we'll go over the box just real quick, just to show you. They have a lifetime warranty. So as long as you register your product, uh, they will cover your, your product from them for life. And you, you literally just get this in the, in the uh, case. So this is the protective case. It is super thin, as you can see here. Um, you know, it's not gonna be that protective for drops or anything like that, but for throwing it in your bag, you're not gonna scuff up your iPad like I've been afraid f for doing on mine. And let's just see how this works. So grab the iPad and I wanna see if I can just let me move this camera out the way. I want to see if I can just put it on without having to take out the iPad uh, and see if that would work that way. And nope, looks like I'll have to. Oh, actually, there we go. And yeah, there it is. It's on. So you don't have to take off your iPad to put it on. And there, it's really, really nice. So now, you know, your iPad is protected the one thing i don't like is you can see let me see if i can show you this here the the cover comes over the uh the keyboard a little bit so it's not flush before it was flush to your um the ipad and the keyboard were flush now this sticks out just a little bit um it won't bother me or anything like that but it is yeah, it does do that. Uh, it has all the cutouts as you would expect. And yeah, I really, I really like this look. Now, the one thing that I wanted to make sure, and I think it will work, is that it works with my stand here. So this is the stand that I use for when I'm writing at the house. So let me try to do this behind the camera. Take off the iPad here like this and that worked and put it in the stand and boom there you go it actually works let me see if i can show you here so i'm laying it down but yeah this is how it looks it actually works perfectly fine in the uh in the stand so that's really cool the one thing that does kind of suck with the bridge keyboard and it's doesn't it's not their fault or anything like that but there's no place to put your apple pencil so i'm thinking about getting something i can stick on the back here that i can put my apple pencil in uh, that was the other thing that i didn't want to do to the ipad was put something on the back of it in case i wanted to change cases uh so that I have that I will pick up. I will leave a link to the one I'm thinking of getting. It's like $10 on Amazon. It's really cheap. And then to put the your iPad back in, you just line it up as you normally would. And put it over that. I always turn it on. But having the, actually having this cut out now, so this is the cutout. It makes it really easy just to line it up and slip it down and you're good to go. Yeah, so this is really nice. I like having the keyboard, the case for this keyboard. Now, if you did get the 2018 or think about getting the 2018 iPad uh, bridge keyboard, it does come with the case. So that is nice to cover. Uh, it doesn't go around the corners like this one does. It just snaps on the back, uh, but it's still some, it's nice to have a case 
on your iPad if you're going to be using it in this bridge keyboard mode. It doesn't impact typing on the keyboard at all, like you can see here, and it doesn't make the iPad. It does if you lean the iPad back, you know, 75 degrees, it does make it a little wobbly. You can see here on the corner, it is a little wobbly where the iPad used to sit flat, but if you're using it at a reasonable um, at a reasonable angle, it actually works fine. So the angle I would normally use it at, it works perfectly fine. Like there's no, there's nothing wrong. I don't usually lean it all the way back. The bridge keyboard, you can actually lean your iPad back 180 degrees. I never do that, but yeah, that's just a quick video of the bridge 2017 bridge uh, cover case for the iPad 12.9. They have one for the uh, iPad 10 and the 9.7, I believe, and maybe even the mini. I'm not sure. I will leave links down below for this one and the keyboard and the iPad that I'm using. Even the, the uh, stand here that I love so much, I will leave links down below for all that. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, let me know if you have any questions about the case or if you guys have a bridge keyboard, do you have the case? Did you pick up the case when it first came out? Uh, I would like to know, let me know down below. Thank you for watching this. Please subscribe and hit the thumbs up if you like it, thumbs down if you don't like it. And I will talk to you next one later. Bye bye.